Oh, hey guys. Uh, as you can see, I'm not like dressed in anything too crazy. I basically woke up and then prepped myself for E3. I just saw the Microsoft press conference and I'm taking a quick break while uh, G4 is going over some of the smaller games and my god, I am freaking out. You know, I'm the 360 fan right now and I was thinking about buying a uh, buying a PS3 for Christmas, but the way this is looking, I don't know if I might cuz uh first of all, let's talk about in my opinion the biggest thing announced I mean, the craziest, I mean, the thing that blew my mind the most, well, it all blew my mind, but the craziest thing is how they ended it. New 360 shipping today to stores, so the, this new slim 360, 250 gigabyte, will be out this week in uh, all retailers, so, for $300, so, I, I need to get away to get rid of this uh, Xbox I have over here, this white thing, get up, get, get with the black stuff, you know what I'm saying? Because, uh... This, I know, if I try to take this to the GameStop, it'll only give me, what, 80 60 dollars $60, probably. 80 if I'm lucky. So, hopefully, uh, GameStop will work out a trading value, get $100, maybe 150 for trading a 360, but, uh, for the purchase of a new Slim 360, but, um, uh, I'm really, I'm trying to get this new 360 ASAP with the Wi-Fi connect ready all this stuff ready for it it's, it looks insane but uh basically what they talked about in the microsoft press conference if you missed it was uh basically they talked about reach what are they talking about there not sure what game but uh they talked about reach which looks they show camp well, they didn't talk about it. they show campaign gameplay and the campaign gameplay blew my mind it was probably the best gameplay they showed at the whole press conference First of all, all the other games, I mean, they showed it, even if you're watching it in your HD TV, the conference was in HD, but the games they showed were in uh, SD, standard definition. But Reach still looked like it was in HD. You got to hear the soundtrack. Marty did a crazy job on the soundtrack. And the whole game just looks epic. It looks like a movie. It looks like you're playing a movie. We also saw Black Ops. That was the first thing they showed. Campaign play of that. Looks really sick. Gives you that Modern Warfare feel, but not mo it's not modern. It gives you that Modern Warfare 2 feel. Looks like they, they just copied off of Modern Warfare 2, but put it push it back a couple of years. So it looks crazy. It looks really good. I'm still going to pick that up. Fable 3, we saw a trailer pretty much, and it looks epic. It just, it just looks crazy. Definitely picking it up six days after my birthday, October 26th. <laughs> Gotta get it. Forza Motorsports with Microsoft Connect, which looks crazy. Microsoft Connect has Connect Video Chat, ESPN Sports, all this movie and all this crazy stuff. I can't handle it. Definitely picking up Connects. And then they have Forza Motorsports for Connects. And they show all these Connect games, which are kind of lame. The only thing that kind of attracted me was the Connect Sports. Probably get that just to utilize the features and maybe uh, Connects racing which is i mean it just depends on the retail price of the games but uh yeah this th these are some crazy things they put out and they ended it with a new 360 a slim model nobody was expecting this and they threw it out crazy gave everybody a free one oprah moment gave everybody a free one at the conference this is crazy so i'm definitely gonna get one of those new uh 360s ea and ubisoft uh conference comes out in about 30 minutes and I don't I doubt I'm probably gonna get this up in time to warn you that you better be watching but uh yeah this is gonna be epic I'm just telling you right now it's gonna be great uh, these games this is probably gonna be the biggest uh, e3 yet I mean I'm, I'm Microsoft blew my mind because that's my home that's my home front right there I'm always on the 360 I don't even have a ps3 yet but I know I probably won't be able to afford one after I get all of this cool awesome stuff so ps3 probably is gonna have to wait another year especially with that activision uh that activision contract man we're killing it new maps always coming first to us all this stuff and i love how sony's like wow wow we got we bungee sound with activision we're gonna get some awesome stuff activision loves us but yeah you're gonna make it multi-platform but activision signed a contract with microsoft microsoft isn't gonna let his prize companies go away like that I just called it his, but whatever. Uh, I'm not trying to be a fanboy, but this Microsoft did blow my mind. I will keep getting updates through the whole week, 
of all the press conferences and all the news. So stay tuned. Uh, it's our Shadow Knight 1994, Arcane 94, whatever you want to call me, Joseph. I don't, I don't care. Uh, but basically, that was the Microsoft press conference. It blew my mind. Ready to get this new 360 with Wi-Fi, so I can take these stupid Ethernet cords out, uh, and I can finally bring the 360 downstairs without having to worry about plugging it up in junk. So, yeah, I'm, I'm psyched. I'm psyched. What can I say? So I'm leaving. I'll leave you off on that note. My bad. Moving the camera. Make sure to comment, rate, and subscribe, especially at a momentous time like this. I don't even know why I'm making a big deal out of this. Because it's E3. That's why I'm making a big deal. But yeah, just make sure you comment, rate, subscribe. Keep up for updates. See ya.